<laughs> I was in a restaurant and the waiter was explaining to me the specials. And he said, the soup of the day is tomato with a hint of basil. And I was like, dude, that's not a hint. You just fucking gave it away. <laughs> The key to a good hint is not to put the answer within it. <laughs> Here's a suggestion of what you should say to your next customer. <clears throat> the soup of the day is tomato plus something beginning with B. <laughs> it's also a man's name. Oh, here we go. I'm so good I get walk-ins. <laughs> I, uh, I was in a cafe, I looked at the menu, there's an item on the menu called a duck sandwich. That kind of made me feel sad in a way. Because I thought, finally, that duck is literally surrounded by bread. <laughs> now he's in no position to enjoy it. <laughs> Big duck sandwich fans over there. So. <laughs> Carl doing duck sandwich is like the Nirvana playing smells like the, Teen Spirit the, Life. The Stones doing Satisfaction. Yes. Yeah, you can't, I can't finish. You've got to, you've got to put it in there. All yeah. the fans go crazy. Yeah. They're like, where is it? The, the attitude of interstate people versus Melbourne. Melbourne take it for, for granted a little bit, their comedy. Sure. Because you can see whoever you want all the time, sort of. But, but people from Perth or Brisbane, that's, I always know when they're there because they'll come up and go, this is amazing. And I'm like, Perth or Brisbane? And they go, <laughs> Brisbane, how did you know? Like, that's what you guys are like. You're extra appreciative. Whereas, you know, people from Melbourne are a little bit like, yeah, I know Will Anderson's been on, Hughes's been on, Denise Scott's been on, but who else is on tonight? Yeah. Like, all right, mate. Whenever I see a bunch of guys all wearing high-vis uniforms, I always think, man, it looks like someone highlighted all the people that didn't finish year 10. <laughs> And who earn more money than me? 